These things are good, you can wrap up a body in them. Hey my friends! This past week has been emotional, nerve-wracking, humbling, and I might as well start this video vlog with last Saturday. We are here in Cottonwood, Arizona at a crafts fair. Mind the gopher holes! I was up until 3.30 a.m. editing, so I'm gonna be so much fun today. Not even being sarcastic, like when I'm tired, I am just loopy, loopy basket of loop. People are staring. Vlogging is not for the timid, because you get some looks. We actually did an antique show here before. Placemats. Didn't buy anything, but we also went to the museum that's next door. And my mom is getting better at filming. Yeah, girl! <laughs> Education is important and I got good grades, but Rex gotta go to school. My son's all about making noise. Where'd he go? Oh my gosh, I want that sweater. I would wear it. Well, this was cool. Skipped Sunday, which brings us to Monday. So I didn't film anything yesterday and nothing for most of today. I'm just nervous. <laughs> You'll know already that on December 4th, my friend Shane asked me to come over to his house and basically sit down and talk about what happened to me. I got on some Shane merch. <laughs> Amazon. His sweaters are actually really comfortable. I have another one. I just wanted to see Shane and hang out and he's like, let's film. And I have not seen the episode myself. Okay, we're ready. We got two minutes. We're gonna make it like a movie theater in here. Ooh. <gasps> it's up. We have our chips. <laughs> And it was brilliant. Shane, you put Rex to sleep. <laughs> Honey, you don't know good content. <laughs> oh my god, this is so good. Okay, no, I need to rewind. <laughs> this is the best part of the video. <laughs> Shane and Andrew are so good at what they do and they work so hard and I really think that they so need a series on Netflix. Maybe everyone tweet Netflix about a Shane Dawson series? Hint, hint, <laughs> do it. And then I couldn't really sleep because I was in shock until Tuesday. I just tried to put the pancake mix straight into the burner. We are really slow moving today. We are in Uptown Sedona. We're gonna go look at tourist shops because we haven't done that in a while and we're kind of running out of things to do because it's such a small town, so we're gonna do it anyway. Mama's gonna get an aura photo. <laughs> totally. Gonna do it. There's so much stuff in this store that Rex can break. Apparently, I have an orange chakra. Orange means adventurous, analytical, scientific, and self-confident. I'm not scientific. <laughs> Liars. We had to bring his pig, his dog, and his car. Rex, let's go look at toys. Ooh, oh, toy Rex. store. Rex, Rex. Oh my gosh, I want this. Rex, do you need a sequin? Rex, come here. Do you need this? Mommy wants to get it for you. Do you want this? Come here. Mommy wants, to it. <laughs> Mommy wants to buy it. Come here. Why is this so satisfying? I feel like this is stress relieving. We found a few little things and then looked at some bunnies. I'm gonna try to respond to all the comments and messages, but there's just so many. I just feel so overwhelmed and I want to thank all of you, but I don't know how. Sleepy baby. Oh, he's so cute. So just thank you. When Rex woke up, I assembled his new kitchen stand. These should be never used unsupervised, but it's something great for when we're cooking with no knives that he can hang out next to us. Would you rate it four cookies out of five or five cookies out of five? How many cookies would you give it? This many? Okay. Steamed vegetables with nutritional yeast and dressing. It may sound gross, but it's actually delicious. We love our newsstand. Wednesday, I stumbled upon some of my old artwork. And this one, I was a freshman in high school, cleaning out the closet and finding stuff. I need to get back to drawing. And I was putting on a brave face all week, but then I finally broke down. I just felt overwhelmed. And it just made me feel kind of frozen. Because 
I just don't know how to thank everyone. And I don't know how to properly thank you guys. I, I don't. I, I can't, like, it's impossible for me to respond to every comment and message. Like, when there's that many, you just can't. And I just, I don't know. It's like, I just, I feel stressed because I want so badly for everyone to know how appreciative I am and how much I care. I don't even know what I'm saying. Sometimes I just have to go in the bathroom, get it out, and then put a smile on my face and go back to loving my son. Happy Valentine's Day! Happy Valentine's Day! <laughs> <laughs> or Thursday for us. I ain't got no Valentine. She ain't got no Valentine and Rex. We have a Valentine right here. We have a valentine right there. You didn't get us anything. You're a horrible valentine. That's right. Is that the one you want for sure? We're picking out our own Valentine's Day gifts. We now have two dogs. You want both of these? He threw these on the ground and grabbed the unicorn. But then he again changed his mind. That was my crazy week. Quick announcement, we are having free shipping on rexkidswear.com with the code REXATINE until Monday. Get it, Valentine, REXATINE. 10% of every sale goes directly to Watoto to help orphans and vulnerable women in Uganda. And our onesies are also really cute. So check it out, link below, link below. Thank you guys for everything. Everything, and I mean literally everything. I'm still overwhelmed. Thank you, Shane, for everything. I just love you dearly. And to all the bad things that happened to you and me, it is time we just let it go and say... Thank you.